living room makeover so i'm going to give you guys a full tour it's going to be excellent i can't wait to see what your thoughts are and i'm also going to tell you how i did it on a small budget and focused my money where i thought i would get the most use out of it mainly this amazing sofa a chaise by the way will completely up like your life game like feet up all the time all the time hi friends Budget Girl here, and as you can see, I am in kind of a new space in my home. If you didn't know, I decided to get a kind of new couch and redo my living room a little bit as a celebration for finishing a very healthy emergency fund. Hi! I am joined today by Tat Tat, my boyfriend Jacob's dog, and Rory, who you all know. So today I'm going to tell you all about how I shopped for high quality furniture at a good deal online, how I stayed in budget, and why this sofa is just perfect. What do you think? They think so. <laughs> so first off, let me tell you why I wanted to redo my living room. Uh, the first thing was is that I had a very tiny love seat that I bought off of Craigslist four years ago, and it just wasn't enough room for dogs and people, and I love to entertain, and it just wasn't good enough. So I decided I wanted primarily a large, new, beautiful sofa. So after I finished saving my fully funded emergency fund, I started saving up for it and for some other things to go in my newly redesigned living room. And that's good because it took me a long time to figure out what kind of couch I wanted and what would work best for me and my life. I looked at every couch on the internet, twice at least. And I finally settled on this one from Article, who is actually today's video sponsor, which is very exciting. I loved this couch. The moment that I saw it online, I knew that it was going to be great quality. It was going to be perfect. I read every single review that has ever been done on this couch. I thoroughly stalked every Instagrammer and blogger who has ever bought this couch and said anything about it. And the reviews were all 100% positive. So once I settled on which couch I wanted, I reached out to Article and I said, hey, I'm going to buy this couch whether or not you guys want to partner, but I also know that I'm going to be talking about this couch a lot, so maybe we can work something out. And Article was amazing! And they were very clear they wanted a 100% honest review, and they just, they're just exciting to work with. So this is the Sven from Article. It is a gorgeous sectional couch. It is 100 inches long, which is enough for like five people at the very least. It is perfect for sitting at home and doing my work on the chaise or cuddling up with Rory or my boyfriend. It is wonderful for entertaining. It is soft, it is plush, it is luxe. It is. It has quite a big seat depth here. <sighs> it is perfect for lounging on and watching TV with my boyfriend or eating here even, I know you shouldn't eat on your couch, but we do anyway, and I just love it. I was a little bit scared about shopping for a sofa online only, and I went to a lot of furniture stores before I decided that I was going to have to take that route. But I am so glad I did. Because Article is an online only store, they actually pass on the savings to the customer by not having storefronts where people have to go in and they staff and light and everything like that. And you guys know I love a direct to consumer discount. Heck yes. They have a limited selection of sofas that have been so well designed and curated and done. And also they ship it to you in less than two weeks on average. Also, and this put my little frugal heart at ease, Article has a 30 day money back guarantee if you don't absolutely love your sofa, which I haven't actually heard of any cases of not. This sofa has thousands and thousands of five star reviews on the internet and I agree with every single one of them. As you can see, Rory has completely, completely stolen the chaise and claimed it as hers. She sits here every single day, looks out that window, and this is where she is when I get home. 
I wanted a sofa that would be chic and kind of modern, or in this case, mid-century modern, and go with the stage of life that I'm in now. I don't have kids, I do have a furry kid, and sometimes a step furry kid, but I wanted something that I could entertain on, that I could lounge on, that I could eat on, that I could like do budget girl stuff on, or just relax and watch TV. I didn't want a marshmallow couch or something gray or tan or some of the other more traditional sofa colors. I wanted something just a little bit special that would be kind of the standout and focal point of this room, which this perfectly fits the bill for. Your eyes immediately go to it. You immediately want to sit down and relax on it. And when you do, it's perfect because it's not too soft. It's not too firm. It is the just one Goldilocks type couch that I was really dreaming of. Now when redoing my living room, I had to make my budget and then decide where I wanted to invest the majority of it. Now you guys know that I am at my very core a very frugal person, but frugal does not mean cheap and frugal does not mean low quality. Frugal means investing in the things that are important to you and then cheaping out other places. And I knew that where I wanted to invest in was my couch. I didn't want to invest in the chairs on the other side of the camera because almost nobody sits in those unless I have a lot of people over. I didn't want to invest a lot of money in my rug or in my DIY coffee table here. I wanted to invest in this because this was where I was going to be spending the majority of my time. Now that also doesn't mean that I didn't decide to get a great deal on the couch. I went with Article because they don't have physical store locations, because they had low shipping rates, and because they are extremely high quality. Every single review that I read on them screams that this sofa stands up to the test of time, that it is soft, that it is worth it. And from my experiences having this in my home for a couple of weeks now, I completely and totally agree. Once I finally made the decision on what couch I wanted, the rest of the room came together like that. I was able to figure out my rug, my throw pillows, my art, get all of those on a dime. Now that this is done, this place really feels like home and like a sanctuary to me. And I can't wait to show you what it looks like now. If you are searching for some high quality new furniture for whatever stage of life that you are in, I've had several of you guys say that you've been shopping for furniture online when I've done tease photos on my Instagram and that it's just kind of exhausting to go through everything. And it really is. I spent literal months while I was saving up to redo this room looking at everything, every single review, every single photo, measuring things out, trying to second guess myself because I am not an interior designer at all. And this to me was the best quality company that I could go with, the best value for the price and the best customer experience too. So personally, I think this sofa was an amazing Deal. And like I said, frugality isn't always about going for the cheapest option. In fact, that can often lead to spending a lot more down the road. I decided to invest in a really quality, elegant piece of furniture that's going to last me so long and I'm going to be able to live my life on without worrying about it breaking down or having to replace it anytime soon. And while I do enjoy shopping to a point, there's nothing I enjoy more than not having to shop because something's been taken care of. Frugality is about balance. And by balancing where my budget went in this room, focusing it on the couch, I've been able to get the other items in here for steel. I was able to really create a really nice room on a very low budget. So I would love to know what you think of my new space down in the comments below and which article sofa you would love to have in yours. Don't forget to follow the link down below to check out their amazing website. Also, don't forget to like this video if you like budgeted makeovers and if you would like to come over for a movie night on this thing because it's awesome.
So personally, I think this sofa was an amazing deal. He didn't like that. <laughs> uh.